In today's episode, we remember freedom fighter and crusader of social justice Babu Jagjeevan Ram, who was born on the 5th of April 1908 in Bhojpur, Bihar. He founded the Akhil Bharatiya Ravidas Mahasabha in Calcutta and the All India Depressed Classes League for involving the depressed classes in the freedom struggle. Jagjeevan Ram played a very active role in the freedom struggle. He became a legislator at the young age of 28 in the year 1936 as a nominated member of the Bihar Legislative Council. When the Congress government was formed in 1937, Jagjeevan Ram was appointed as the parliamentary secretary in the Ministry of Education and Development. However, in 1938, he resigned along with the entire cabinet. Inspired by Gandhiji, Jagjeevan Ram courted arrest on the 10th of December 1940. After his release, he entrenched himself deeply into the civil disobedience movement. Jagjeevan Ram was arrested again on the 19th of August 1942 for his active participation in the Quit India movement. After his release, he became the youngest minister in the interim government in 1946. As a member of the Constituent Assembly of India, he ensured that social justice was enshrined in the Constitution. Jagjeevan Ram went on to serve as a minister with various portfolios for the next 30 years. He was the Defence Minister of India during the Indo-Pak War of 1971, which resulted in the creation of Bangladesh. His contribution to the Green Revolution in India and modernizing Indian agriculture during his two tenures as Union Agriculture Minister are still remembered. We salute the great nationalist. We also remember Mahatma Gandhi's second son, Manilal Gandhi, who died on the 5th of April 1956. Manilal was born on the 28th of October 1892 in Rajkot, British India. Between 1906 and 1914, he lived at the Phoenix Settlement and Tolstoy Farm established by Gandhiji. After a brief visit to India, Manilal returned to South Africa in 1917 to assist in printing the newspaper Indian Opinion. Manilal also endeavoured hard to stay as true to the Gandhian ethos as possible. Manilal went to prison several times for protesting against what he perceived as unjust laws. Former South African President Nelson Mandela had once recalled that Manilal's gentle demeanour seemed the personification of non-violence. Manilal was one of the initial 78 marchers to accompany Gandhiji on the 1930 Salt March. He also served a 10-month prison term for his involvement in the march to Dharsana Salt Works that followed soon after Dandi. Manilal remained editor of Indian Opinion until 1956, the year of his death. We salute the great Gandhian. We remember freedom fighter Nawab Singh Chauhan, who died on the 5th of April 1981. Nawab Singh was born on the 16th of December 1909 in Aligarh, Uttar Pradesh. He was expelled from the college for raising anti-British slogans. During the Satyagraha in 1940, Nawab Singh Chauhan led villagers in Aligarh. He was arrested and spent almost three years in jail. After independence, Nawab Singh joined politics and served as a member of Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha. He worked towards empowerment of depressed classes, rural development and agricultural research. Nawab Singh was also known for his Hindustani poetry and used the pen name Kanj as a poet and worked towards development of bridge literature and art. We salute the great Indian. <laughs> 